Uh, okay, here I ask you. Uh, I want to ask you in English, which book did you read? Which book did you read? How will you translate? Karata. Kara karata, fine. That is your verb. Huh? Which book? Ayya kitab. <laughs> because it comes as a mafulun being for? Huh? Which lesson did you write? Ayya darsin katapta. Are you with me? Why? Because these are katapta, karata, hafista. Okay? Uh, these are all transitive verbs. What are they? Mutaddi. So that is why if you have ayya, it, it is mafulun bihi coming in front. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So ayya is mafulun bihi wa huwa mudaf and Suratin is mudaf ilayhi and hafiz is your hafiz I said I didn't say brother hafiz 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 fial where is the file T. and what is this anti doing here it is for emphasis it is for emphasis for emphasis mashallah what is the answer ana and then Hafiz tu Surat al Hadid. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What is Ana? Muftada, mashallah. So, where is your khabar? Jumla failia. So, let us analyze Jumla failia. Hafiz, fail, tu, and then Surata, mafulun bi, wahua, and then mudafilay. Mashallah, mashallah. Wa ataf, hiya. And then, Atwalu. Khabar, mashallah. Min suratil Rahmani. Are you with me, brother? Translate, brother. And it is more longer, longer than Surah Rahman. Mashallah, mashallah, mashallah. So, you got the idea, brother. So, Atwalu is here also comparative degree. How do, why, why I say comparative? Min has come to guide me. Okay? Longer than. Huh? So, brother, Atwalu is your uh, khabar. Khabar. Atwalu is khabar. Huh? Why it is Atwalu and not Atwalun? Why it is single Dhamma? Is it coming as a mudaf? No. Then why it is single Dhamma Atwalu? Diptod, mashallah. Why? Because it is diptod. You got to remember that. Huh? Of course, Sister Sukhaina, you are right when you say it is on the vazan of Afa'alu, but we must remember these are all diptods. Very good. And then min comes, brother. Arfjar. Isam majroor. Where is the Isam majroor? Surati. Wahua. Mudaf. And then. Mudafilihi. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Wa kazalik. Now, wa kazalik. Likewise, brothers and sisters, I won't go in detail here. Uh, just to tell you, the ka is also harf jar. And zalik is some majroor. But we are going to learn later on that, okay? Wa kazalik. And likewise, hafiz, tu, sitta, asharata, ayatan, Min suratin nabai. Okay, brother and sister. Here we have to, we come across numbers. So I will write down the number. Sitta asha ra ta aya tan. Remember, I will repeat again, brother and sisters. Number one and two, they are always not manut. And then from three to ten, they are always mudah mudah ilayhi. And you got to always remember al-adad and al-madud. Remember, adad is the number, madud is the thing counted. Okay? Remember? And so we know how to count up to ten. Now in this 
lesson we are learning to count from 11 to 19 when the madud is oneness. We already learned in lesson number 3 I believe uh, when the madud was muzakkar. Remember? You <coughs> ahada ashara taliban ifna ashara taliban and how did we count 13? Salasata ashara taliban remember? Arbaata ashara taliban khamsata ashara taliban sittata ashara taliban Sabata ashara taliban. Okay, and then we did samaniyata ashara taliban. Tisata ashara taliban and ishruna taliban. Now we come to muannas. Huh? How many words are there in the adad? It's a compound. Huh? Brothers and sisters, it is a compound. Huh? Part one and part two. From 13 to 19. Now, this comes with practice when you write it, inshallah. When from 13 to 19, okay, if the madud is muannas, uh, then the second part matches, the first part goes opposite. That's all. Uh, this is to be remembered, okay, brothers and sisters. Sitta asharata. Uh, Ayatan. What is ayatan? Tamiz. MashaAllah. You will remember, huh? From 11 to 99, you will have madud coming as a tamiz. Remember? And from 3 to 10, it will come as a mudaf ilahi. Huh? And again from 100, it will also come as a mudaf ilahi, but it will be singular. But from 11 to 99, it will be singular, it is, will be mansub, it will be indefinite, and we call it tamiz, mashallah. Now again we have to remember that from 11 to 19, uh, they are mabni. They do not change. They do, whether it is a file, uh, or it is mafulun bihi, or it is ism majroor, they will not change. It will remain same. So here is Hafiz tu. Okay, Hafiz fiel. Hafiz fiel. There is the file tu. I memorized. Can I ask a question? What did you memorize? The answer is Sitta Asharata Ayatan. Now, do you think that this Fata is because it is Mafulun uh, Bihi? Uh, no, no, no. This fata is mabni. Huh? If it is marfu, it will remain mabni. If it is mansub, it is already mabni. Okay? So right now, your mafulun bihi is sitta asharata. What is it, brother and sister? What is your mafulun bihi? Sitta asharata. And what is ayatan? Tamiz. MashaAllah. Huh? And then min harf jar surati isim majrur and nabai. Mudaf mudafili. Very good. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Inna ki. Huh? So ki is your ismu inna mansu. And where is khabar inna? Talibatun. And what is this mujtahidatun doing here? It is naad. Ana mubtada masruratun khabar biki. Jar Majur. Got the idea? Biki Jar Majur. Fine. What is the translation? I'm very happy. I'm happy with you. Mashal. I'm happy. In Naki Taliban Mujtahidun. How will you translate? Truly, you are a hard working student. Mashallah. Azhabti ilal maktabati al yawm. Azhabti ilal maktabati al yawma. Al Yauma Zarf, brother. What is the translation? Did you go to the library today? It's so fine, brother. Naam. Zahab tu. Zahab tu. What is this? This is this is a jumla failure. Where is the fiel? 
Zahab. Where is the file? Two. MashaAllah. Now the mother is asking, Maza karati hunaka? What is hunaka? Zarf. Zarf huh? makan. Fine. Maza karati. What did you read? What is the answer? Karatu. See, the verbs are very simple. Anta, anti. And then when you reply, you become ana. Karati, karatu. Karata, karatu. Are you with me? See the, how the, the verbs are used? We have to keep it in mind that, you know. Karatu, majallatan. Okay, brothers and sisters? Karatu, I read. Read what? You get the answer. Majallatan. So what is majallatan? Mafulun bihi. Kara, fiel, tu, file. Okay? Min Pakistana. Jar majur. Right? Ismuha. I would like you to put a full stop there. For simplicity. Put a full stop. Ismuha. What kind of a compound is this? Mudaf, mudaf, ilihi. Ismuha. So... Is, is it Jumla Felia Ismiya? Ismuha? Jumla Ismiya. What are we looking for? Muftada. Where is Muftada? Ismu, mashallah. Wa huwa mudaf and then mudaf ilayhi. What is the khabar? Al isla mu. Khabar is always marfu. If the khabar is one word, it is always marfu, mashallah. Al, al umu. How will you translate this, brothers and sisters? Is it in Arabic language? La. Hiya. Billugatil. Inklesiati. Okay, brother. It is in English language. So what is hiya? Uh, where is our khabar? Billugati. What is billugati? Jar majroor. Now you will say shibu jumla khabar. And what is al arbiyati? Naat. Mashallah, mashallah. Azati ila al mudirati. What is the answer? La. Hiya ma jaat al yawma. This is another word, brothers and sisters. Look at the word. Jaa. See, like kala huh? and zada. This is also a weak word. And it will not conjugate the way we are used to. We can go only up to Huma. Can you conjugate a little bit, brother? Ja'a, Ja'a, Ja'u, Ja'at, Ja'ata. Khalas. The rest we'll do later on. So, here, what is here? Oh, where is the khabar? Jumla failure, huh? Okay. Ma is harfu nafi. What is ja'at? Where is the fial? Ja'a. And what is ta? Tau ta nisi. And where is the file? Where is the file? Mustatir. Mashallah. Takdiruhu. Hiya. Yadullu Allah. That hiya in the beginning. Mashallah. Are you with me, brother? Never ever say Tau Tanisi as a file. I got a very weak heart. I'll get a heart attack. Huh? Okay. Al Yauma is Zarf. Now the thing is Lima. What is the meaning of Lima? Why? Why? Why she did not come? Ja is to come. Ma Jaat means she did not come today. She did not come today. Lima. Why? Azunnu. Now we are learning something more, brother and sister. Azunnu. What is the meaning of Azunnu? I think. I think. Okay. What is Madi? What is Madi, brother and sister? Huh? Zanna. This is also a verb which we'll do later on. Zanna. Do you see a Shadda there? Huh? How many letters are there? What are they, brother? Zanana. What is it? Zanana. But we are not going to uh, go in detail. It will come later on. But for simplicity, 
Zanna is Mahdi, Mahdi, and Bab Nasara. What did I say? Bab Nasara. What will be? Ya, Ya, Zunnu. Are you with me? Ya, Zunnu. That is your Mudariya. But then if I tell you, Zanna Ya Zunnu, and I say Ya Zunnu, five in your pocket, Ya Zunnu, Ta Zunnu, Ta Zunnu, Azunnu, Nazunnu. Yazunnu, he thinks. Tazunnu, she thinks. Again, Tazunnu, you think. Azunnu, I think. Nazunnu, we think. Where, is, where are the files in this? Mustatir. The files are Mustatir. Okay? Fine. Azunnu. The answer is Azunnu. What kind of a jumla is this? Jumla failure, brother. Azunnu, I think. And now comes the Anna. Now this is, as we know, Anna is the sister of Inna. And what is the meaning of Anna? Inna means verily, truly. And Anna means that. T-H-A-T. That. Huh? Anna is that. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Anna is that. Men akhwatu inna. What will, what does inna do? It makes muftada into ismo inna. See, remember, I, the day one I told you, if you can remember, I said, ashadu anna. I said to you, ashadu anna muhammadan. You all said muhammadan. Remember? Ashadu Anna. What is Muhammadan? Ismu Anna. Ismu Anna Mansubun. Huh? When you say Ashadu Anna Muhammadan, the Anna and then Muhammadan is Ismu Anna. And where is the khabar in that case? Ashadu Anna Muhammadan Abduhu wa Rasuluhu. This is your khabar. We'll go some other time in detail. Huh? Now, brothers and sisters, as I said to you, that Anna, brothers and sisters, Anna can also have pronoun attached to it. Can we attach 14 pronouns to it? I think we can. We are, now we are expert, brother. Inshallah. Ready? Annahu, Annahuma, Annahum, Annaha, Annahuma, Annahunna. Annaka, Annakuma, Annakum, Annaki, Annakuma, Annakunna, and then Annani or Anni, both will be correct. And then Annana or Anna, both will be correct. Are you with me? Annahu, Annahuma, Annahum. So what is Anna? Arhu Tawkid wa Naspin. And what is who? Ismu Anna Mansubun. Ready? Annahu, Annahuma, Annahum. Annaha, Annahuma, Annahunna. Annaka, Annakuma, Annakum. Annaki, Annakuma, Annakunna. Anni, Anna. You can also say, Annani. Annana. So all these pronouns are coming as Ismu Anna Mansubun. Mansub. Remember Mansub. Okay, fine. Brothers and sisters. Azunnu. And that is Annaha. So Anna is Minakhwatu. Inna. And what is Ha? Ismu Anna Masbun. Now remember. We have learned khabar can be of five kinds. Huh? Five kinds. So whenever the concept of khabar will come, we will always keep those five kinds of khabar in our mind. Number one khabar, if it is one word. Huh? And then number two khabar, it could be jar majur shibu jumla. Number third khabar, it could be zarf. And then mudafili. Number fourth khabar, Jumla failure. And number fifth khabar? Jumla ismiya. So what kind of a khabar is this here? Jumla failure coming as a khabar for 
أن ما شاء الله ما شاء الله أظن أنها ذهبت ما شاء الله ما شاء الله إلى مكة 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 وين مكة ديب توت برادر ديب توت أوكي برادر أنت سيد ذهبت ها where is the fiel ذهبت what is this تاو تانيس where is the fiel where is the fiel مستطير you have to say fiel on مستطير تقديره هي يدل على ها where it goes to أنها are you with me brothers and sisters إلا مكة جار مجرور ما شاء الله ما شاء الله there are only four sentences I'll finish it brother أشربت شاية أشربت شاية what is the translation did you drink the tea if I say أشربت then the question is what did you drink أشربت شاية okay brother and sister where is the fiel شرب شرب only where is the file and what is the shaya? Mafulbi. Oh, mashallah. Huh? My mouth is watering now. <laughs> Tea time soon, inshallah. What was the answer? La. Huh? La. And then ma sharib tu. Now here mafulun bi should be there. Ma sharib tu hu. But it is understood. Mafulun bi is here understood. Shariba is a transitive verb. It should have mafulun bihi. But if you say, ma sharib tu, I didn't drink. But the tea is still there. I didn't drink it. Huh? Remember that. Okay, fine. Lil khadimati. What is khadimati? To the servant. Huh? Hati. What is the meaning of hati? Bring. Bring. What kind of a verb is this? Fialu amar. Huh? Where is the file, brothers and sisters? Ya, which, is, which means anti. Hati shaya ya layla. Bring tea, O layla. Shaya again, mafulun bihi. Are you with me? File is ya of anti. And then Maryam is saying, Wahati and bring. And also bring. Okay, again the file is ya. Bring what? Keta ata. Huh? A piece. Piece of what? Bread. Khubzin, huh? bread. Huh? So brothers and sisters, Hati is a fail amar. File is ya. And then kit ata is your mafulun bihi. Wa huwa mudaf. And khubzin is. And what is this aidan? Mafulun matlab. We are going to learn later on inshallah. Ya layla. Huh? Oh Layla, bring a piece of bread also. Why she's asking that? An ana jawa. Ana jawa. Huh? What is jawa, brother? I'm hungry. But we we learn that ana jawanu, and here it is ana jawa. Why? What have this is feminine? We are going to learn. Huh? Jawanu is masculine. And if the sister says, I'm hungry, she will say, Ana Java. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Alhamdulillah, I hope you understood. So, an, Ana Java, what kind of a sentence is this? Jumla Ismail. What are we looking for? Where is Muftada? What is Java? No, Khabar. Khabar, it's one word. It's Khabar. Mubtada and khabar, khalas. Halwa puri. Very simple. Okay? Now, inshallah, we'll have some cake and halwa puri, inshallah. Okay, we'll take a tea break. Inshallah. We'll practice again, brother. We're going to practice sakana. He lived. Ready? Madi again. Sakana, sakana, sakanu, sakanat, sakanata, sakanna. Sakanta, Sakantuma, Sakantum, Sakanti, Sakantuma, Sakantuna, Sakantu, Sakanna. Hua, Ana, Anta, Anti, Nahnu, Hum, Sakanu, Hunna, Sakanna, 
antum sakantum huh? antunna sakantunna so inshallah if you remember huh? yaskunu are you with me sakana yaskunu five in your pocket yaskunu taskunu taskunu askunu naskunu got the idea brother and sister now we do the whole thing okay yaskunu yaskunani yaskununa hiya taskunu taskunani hunna yaskunna hunna yaskunna anta taskunu taskunani taskununa anti taskunina taskunani antunna taskunna ana nahnu taskunu ma sha Allah ma sha Allah one more time brother darasa huh? let us do madi quickly darasa darasa darasu darasat darasata darasna darasta darastuma darastum darasti darastuma darastunna darastu darasna anta anti ana nahnu huwa hiya hum hunna darasna antum darastum anti antunna ana nahnu ma sha Allah darasa yadrusu are you with me yadrusu five in your pocket yadrusu tadrusu tadrusu adrusu nadrusu so easy brother very easy now we do the whole thing yadrusu yadrusani yadrusuna hiya tadrusu tadrusani hunna yadrusna hunna yadrusna anta tadrusu tadrusani tadrusuna anti tadrusina tadrusani antunna tadrusna ana adrusu nahnu nadrusu we will this because lesson number 10 all the time these two words will be used inshallah in mudariya and you will find it very easy inshallah Brothers and sisters, Ajib Anil Asilatil Atiati. Answer the following questions. Okay, brother. Those who have new books, the vowel signs are there. Those who have old book, there are no vowel sign. But you see the verb Hafiza Saidun. So Hafiza is a transitive verb. So what will happen to Ayu? Ayya Mashaala. Ayya Suratin. Hafiza Saeedun. What will you answer, brother? Which, ha, which translation? Which surah Hafiz memorized? Huh? Or what will your answer? Hafiza Saeedun. Surata Rahmani. Surata Mafulun Bihi Rahmani. Are you with me? Inshallah. Okay. Brother, Kam Ayatan. Kam after Kam Ayatan has come. What is Ayatan? Tamiz, mashallah. Kam ayatan min surat tin nabai hafizat maryamu. Okay. Translation, brother. How many verses from surah naba Maryam memorized? What is the answer? Hafizat maryamu sitta asharata ayatan. Brother, here it is ashrata. Uh, make it sukoon here, brother. Uh, ashrata. Hmm? Ashrata. Okay. Masmul majallati karaat ha maryamu fil maktabati. What will be the translation? Masmul majallati. What is the name of the magazine which Maryam read it uh, in the library? Bi ayyi logatin hiya. In which language? See now ayyi. Why it ayyu became ayyi? Bi harf char came. Harf char is a majur. Bi ayyi logatin hiya. Huh? Are you with me? What will you say? Ismuha. Why ha? Because it is magazine. Mohannas. Ismuha al-Islamu. What will you say? 
اسموہا الاسلام وحیہ باللغت الانکلیزیاتی یا باللغت الانکلیزیاتی گوڈ برادر you got to write it huh brothers and sisters never shy away from writing writing will make you very strong inshallah da hadhihi al alama okay da hadhihi al alama ta da is amar also put ha amam al jumla al sahiha wa hadhihi al alama amam al jumla al ghair sahi we know what to do inshallah now we got to figure out is the sentence correct or not what is in the book ma fariha ma fariha al mudarri su bi saidin the teacher was not happy with said that is the translation is it correct no it is wrong huh? huh? fariha al mudarri su bi saidin fine huh? maryam jawa is it correct yes kharajat maryam min al madrasati baad salat al zuhri is it correct yes surah ar rahman atwal min surah al hadid no it is the other way round surah al hadid atwal min surah ar rahman Aminatu wa Fatimatu wa Suadu Zamilatu Maria Ma Mashallah Maria Ma huh? Correct? Very good brother Okay Now here are some questions which has got no relationship with the dars huh? You have to reply on your own brother and sisters you will reply on your own. if you are ask if i have to ask a sister then i will say azhabti ila al madrasati al yawm if i have to ask a brother i will say azhabta ila al madrasati al yawm what will be your answer naam zahabtu or you will say la ma zahabtu whatever but make it naam it's good to go to school <laughs> okay mata rajata or mata rajati depends whom you are asking mata rajata min al madrasati rajatu baada salat al zuhur or baada dars you can say ayya suratin karata baada salat al fajri what is the translation which surah did you read after salat al fajri what will you say karatu surah al yasin whatever you want to say ha huh? okay mashallah next one brother ayya suratin why ayya because there is a verb here transitive verb inside okay ayya suratin hafista what will you translate which surah did you memorize hadha al usbu ah remember it is usbu ah very soon we are going to understand this okay brother al usbu a al usbu a what can it be brother and sisters al usbu a al usbu a it is a zarf mashallah huh? what is it just like al yawma al usbu a it is a zarf zarf us zaman brother and sisters but before zarf us zaman something else came so haza came before zarf us zaman so what happens to haza what shall we call haza it is this no shara and if you say this i say no this no no muftida brother because this is jumla failure no in situation like this we are going to st- study in detail later on but every time it will come and i will remind you and i will remind you so many times that it will come out of your both ears okay <laughs> so haza here is a zarf what is zarf here haza are you with me okay and then if haza is a zarf and what is al usbu'a badal 
Are you with me? If I say, Al Yawma, what is Al Yawma? Zarf. Uh, if I say, Haza Al Yawma, so where is the Zarf now? Haza. And what is Al Yawma? Badal. Are you with me? Haza Al Masa'a. So Masa'a, evening, that is your Zarf. But if I put Haza in front, then the Haza becomes Zarf. We are going to learn all these things in book 3 in detail. But I will be pointing out to you from time to time so that you can prepare yourself. It's not difficult. Huh? When there is a zarf and in front of it is a smu ishara, then that smu ishara is taking the place of the zarf. And after smu ishara, if it is al usbu'a, then it becomes badal. Al yawma, it will become badal. Al masa'a, it will become Badal. Huh? Are you with me, brother and sister? Inshallah. I will be, I will be guiding you, brother and sister. Ayya suratin hafiz ta hadal usbu'a. What will your answer? Which surah did you memorize? Hafiz 2. Surat al-Rahmani, you can say. And again, you can say hadal usbu'a if you want to. If you want to. If you don't say, it is understood. Okay, brother and sisters. Very good, brother and sister. Now, again, we have to be very careful. Remember, what is coming? A uh, and um. We got to separate them. Huh? Two things. If there are two mafulun bihi, one mafulun bihi will come with a, uh, and the second mafulun bihi come after um. Look at this. Abil ma'il baridi, gasalta wajhaka, am bil ma'il hari. What is the translation? Warm water. But look at it, brother and sisters. Two things we are asking. Al-Ma'u Barid and Al-Ma'u Har. And Harf Jar came. So Bil Ma'i Barid and Bil Ma'i Har. Okay? So they came separately. You got to watch for it. Huh? And then Gasalta. What is Gasalta? Fiel file. Where is your Mafulun Bihi? Wajha. Wajha ka two words. Mudaf mudaf ilahi. So wajha is your mafulun bihi. Wahuwa mudaf and mudaf ilahi. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Inshallah. What should be your answer? Of course we can only say hot water. Gasaltu wajhi. Gasaltu wajhi. I wash my face with bilmail ha. Inshallah. If you are brave enough, then you can wash with cold water. <laughs> okay. Okay. Man gasala kamisaka wa mindi laka mindi laka kamisaka mudaf mudafilei mindi laka mudaf mudafilei. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay. Who washed it, brother? You, so how will you answer? Gasalat. I'll say, you can say Gasalat Ummi, or you can say Gasalat Ukhti, or you can say Gasalat Zawjati, my wife. Huh? Are you with me, brother and huh? And then, Kami Saka will become? Kami Si. Mashallah, brother Hassan. Kami Si and Mindi Li. Remember? We got to change the pronouns. Are you with me, Susan Ustad? Kamisaka will become Kamisi. Huh? And my, okay, remember. Okay. Fine. Annis al file. Annis al file. Make the file muannas. Very easy, brother. Very easy. Okay, where is the file, brother? A sharibta shaya ya hamid. Where is the file? Ta. Ta. Where is the file? Ta. Make it more less. A sharibti. A brother. Khalas. A sharibti shaya. Then you have to change the munada. Huh? Whom you are addressing. You change it. Brother, this is very easy. Very easy. This is absolutely halwa puri. Sister Halima. Your is first. A katapta darsa ya ali. What will you say? Uh-huh. 
Ya Fatima. Say anything. Huh? Take any name. You can say Ya Halima. Katabti Darsa Ya Halima. Okay, are you with me? MashaAllah. Now this is all, that's all you have to do. Now, of course, come on, give me a break. I know Katabta is Muzakkar, Katabti is Mu'annas, that's all. So brother, that's why I say it is Halwa Puri. Sister Arifa, Agasalti, Waj, Waj, Ha. If you say Wajhu, then it is wrong. Wajha. Why Wajha, sister? But Gasalti. Did you wash? Wash what? You need Mafulun Bihi. Got the idea? You will always ask this question to the worm. What is that question? What and whom? If you get a proper answer, that is your Mafulun Bihi. Agasalti Wajha. He. And then you change the name. Or is, uh, okay. Sister Aisha. Ya binti. Khalas. Mashallah. Excellent. Sister Memuna. Mashallah. Afahinti darsal jadida. Excellent. Mashallah. Sister uh, Nasreen. Bada dar. Bada dar, zarf, okay, inshallah. Bada darsi, ya ukhti, you can say, sister manas, that's it. Allah puri. Now you are getting a tough thing. Brothers, sisters, remember, look at this what I am writing. No vowel sign. No vowel signs. How many possibilities are there? Four possibilities. Zahabta, Zahabti, Zahabtu, and Zahabat. Huh? So you will look into the sentence and figure out. And it's very interesting and very easy. Huh? What is it? Ana? Zahabtu. Khalas, brother. It's easy. Huh? And next one, Ya Yusufu. Azahabta. Okay. Ukhti Zahabat. Because it's third person. Ukhti Zahabat, my sister. Okay. And then Ya Fatima. Azahabti. See how easy it is, brother. You will be able to figure out. Huh? But it becomes easier with you because you work hard at your conjugation. And please don't forget, every day, do two, two conjugation. I don't want you to do more than two. Just two conjugation and finish that page six, inshallah. Very good. So, ta'ammal, ponder, ma yali, what follows. So, same thing that I wrote, it has got four possibilities. Zahabat, zahabta, zahabti, zahabtu. Okay. Now comes something else, brother and sister. Tammal lil misalaini il ati yaini. Ponder over the two following examples. Afahimta darsa ya ali. Afahimta darsa ya ali. What is it, brothers and sisters? Translation? Did you understand? There is no negation. Did you understand? Answer will be yes and no. Now, if Put it in a negative form, the question. Ama fainta darsa ya ali? What is the translation? Didn't you understand the lesson? So what will be your answer? Bala for yes, I understood. And if you say no, I didn't understand, how will you say? Naam. <laughs> because when you say naam, you are agreeing with the statement. Then first you will say naam and then you will say, I did not understand. Are you with me? Brother Muhammad, yes. did you get the idea? Yes. When it is in negation, and if you agree with the question, then you will say, Naam. Didn't you understand the dars? Yes, means I didn't understand. And then you will say, Ma, fine too. Little tricky. Okay, but we will inshallah understand it. 
you will get more understanding if you will sit down and write, huh? brothers and sisters. And you all have hello tamari. First, I will request you to write your answers and then check with hello tamari. Huh? Hello tamari. Don't go into the hello tamari first. That will defeat the uh, purpose of learning, brother. Okay.